replication that we're talking about is going to be from the opening move from the cut to MP. Okay? Hand is open, hand is under like this, and I drop down this way. Hand comes down, step out, right hand comes across this way. Okay? So a very, very simple uh, um, application for this from a grappling position. Normally you'll see a karate style attack where if somebody's dropping down with one knee, it must mean they're getting kicked in the face, right? So if the kick comes in, there's no way I'm going to put my hand in here or even try to deflect the kick from being down here. If I did try to deflect the kick and I was successful, if that kick comes in, boom, what about the hand to my face, which is going to be coming next? All right, so to me, that interpretation is just not valid because of what can happen. So I wouldn't do that. However, if we start off in a in a clinch position, okay, I'm clinching. This is a, a an overhook and an underhook. What I'm going to do from here is I'm going to take my feet. I'm going to slip over, and then I'm going to step out to my left, just like the kata says. Then I'm going to take this arm and I'm going to seize the tricep muscle and start to pull it down. As I pull it down, he starts to load that leg. Okay? I drop straight down. Then my hand comes out to create a lever, but I pull it down. And that's the opening. It's one application for the opening move. This hand is pulled down. This hand comes here. I drop and pull off to the side. Let's watch it again. We're clinched. I give a little headbutt. I can bite him just to offset him. And then I step to the side. I step out. Step out and pull. Load the front leg. Drop down, push him, and he's off. So if he slid away, roll it, roll out for him. It just looks like this. Okay, so that's our 